OpenAI dropped a bunch of major announcements at OpenAI Dev Day 2025 last week. And no, these are not just model tweaks. They have hit a reset button on how you build AI. OpenAI is pivoting from being a model provider to a platform builder. I will walk through five announcements, then share what you should do next to leverage them. Point one, apps inside ChatGPT. Apps SDK lets you embed interactive apps directly in chat. You could launch a booking, design, or search application that lives inside ChatGPT. But you see, apps alone aren't enough. You need autonomous agents. So say hello to Agent Kit. Now Agent Kit provides tools to build agents, not just models. The drag and drop agent flow, connector registry, evaluation pipelines, all of these come within Agent Kit. This bridges prototype to real world scalability. But all that scale needs compute muscle. Hence, OpenAI announced strategic partnership with AMD. Scaling AI is as much as hardware as it is software. With more compute, they can push new model or tool upgrades easily. And that brings us to announcement four, this model and tooling upgrades. OpenAI announced Sora 2 API integration, codex improvements, real-time model variants. And this means you can build richer media, faster interactive responses, and stronger code support. Now, to make all of this work, you need an audience base. You need users. So let's talk about number five, ChatGPT scale and ecosystem visions. Now, Sam Altman announced that ChatGPT has hit 100 million plus weekly users, turning it into an app store. Your product could live inside ChatGPT's ecosystem and you get access to all of those users. So in summary, those are the five major takeaways from DevDay. Now these aren't just new toys, they challenge how you plan product, how you design architecture, how you think about partnership, and how you think about deployment in 2026. I'm unpacking more such insights on YouTube. Subscribe if you want to stay ahead of the AI platform. If you like this video, comment and share it with your friends. See you next time, bye.